yeah. Baby, I've been serving L's like the weed man. Ain't even sign yet, you could get a freelance. I'm walking in with a bag like I'm in the NBA. Feel like I'm always vacationing like I'm Chevy Chase. Before these shorties come on says I need an NDA. I swear my life getting crazy, gon' bust off any day, yeah. Hey. Fitness. We're back, we're on the field, you know what I'm saying? We're with boy Shannon, you know what I'm saying? We're about to go crazy, we're gonna run some routes, drills, a bit of handwork, and yeah, I'm gonna do a QA when I get back to the house, so stay tuned, hope you like the video. And I've been away for a minute, but we're we'll back in it. Fuck quarantine. <laughs> Tell out here, boy. We're gonna put in this work, man. Let's go. I want to post, about to kill some posts. Come bro, let's make it happen, let's go. So, we had to do the 40 yard dash, I'm pretty sure. Most athletes are well aware of what a full yard dash is. We're lined up, we're gonna set up here. Let's go see how fast we can run this. I ran a full yard dash in a minute. Last time I did it, it was like five something. But yeah, I've got a bit heavier since then, so we're gonna see how this goes. But you know what's gonna do then. Let's go though, let's get this game. Three, two, one, go. Hop, hop, hop. Just keep it moving, straight. There you go, keep moving. Three, two, one, go. You know what I'm saying? Boy's still flying, you know what I'm saying? Alright, I'll track the video. I'm gonna see you at the house. I should not like to wait Alright, yo, yo, we just wrapped up the session in the park. It was a good session with my boy Shannon. Make sure you follow his Instagram. I'm gonna have it somewhere on the screen, anywhere on the screen. But yeah, if you like, if you want more videos like this, let me know and I'll keep doing them. But yeah, if you didn't know, I was injured. So my friend, let me show you. So oh, I was injured, hence why I haven't been on the field in ages, but obviously it feels good to be back. I'm a bit stiff still, and you kind of need to loosen up again, get my, my routes crisp again, but you know, be back stronger and better than ever. But um, this ain't really the main focus, it's more powerlifting. So when the gym's open again, we're back on my shit. First comp, hopefully by the end of the year. Because I was meant to do one in June, I was, you know, got suspended, bullshit, but you know what I'm saying, we'll be back. But obviously I'm gonna sit at the house and we do a Q&A. It's your boy, I'm saying. Hey. Yo, yo, it's your boy CJ Fitness. It's another day. I went, oh my day, it's like the following day after the workout. I haven't thought of it, yeah. So this is the next day. I don't the session I had with Shannon. I was kind of tired when I got back home at eight, stuff like that. But yeah, so I want to QA for you now. So I'm going to start off with the first question. It goes, where do I want to be in five years from now? So five years from now, um, I want to be, you know, a couple competitions deep into powerlifting. So I would have expected to walk, like won a couple competitions. You know, hopefully competing at a decent level. Um, what else do I want to do? That's in terms of like the fitness side, and obviously do like I don't know like see how much I could progress in YouTube. So like 
I don't know, excel within the YouTube scene. That's another thing I want to be doing within five years from now. Um, what else? In terms of like outside of fitness, um, well, to be honest, I'm doing half decent outside of fitness already. So, um, you know, I'm a supervisor in my hospital that I work in. So, yeah, there's that. Like, in terms of like real life stuff, I'm doing pretty well. So, like, I'm doing alright with that. But it's more like, probably like mainly just fitness related in five years from now, to be honest. Um, what else? Next question. Um, <laughs> are you staying home? <laughs> well, I'm a key worker, so I go to work still, but yeah, other than that, I'll come home, stay home, and just do my, you know, push-ups and sit-ups and all that good stuff. Um, next question says, if you could wake up and be anywhere in the world, where would it be? <laughs> Miami, I'm not going to lie, Miami's like my dream, my dream place. Miami or New York? I feel like Miami more though, but like, I love New York too, so one of the two, one of the two. Um, what other questions have we got? <laughs> On a scale of 1 to 10, how much do I miss gym? Hey, there's not even a number <laughs> to explain how much I miss gym. See, gym, it's hard to explain, like, um, when I tell people it's more than just a gym, it really is. It's like, because I go to gym, literally, like, religiously, I don't, I never fall off, I'm always there. When you take, it's like, it's become like a part of my life, isn't it? So when you take it out, I'm like kind of lost about it. Like I come home and I'm just like, what do I do? Like I can't just sit there and just watch films and be late. I can't do it. It doesn't work. So I'm a bit lost right now. So I just miss it. I'm a trillion. <laughs> yeah. Um, a lot of questions that we've got. Does creatine work and do you take it? Well, um, when I was at the gym, yeah, I did take creatine and it does work. Like, I think it, I think they say it's like probably like the most studied um, supplement out there and it definitely does work because when I started taking it, I definitely gained a little bit more size and my strength went up considerably. So I would suggest it, that it does work. I wouldn't say not to use it, it does work. It's just like any other, really, like other supplement. It doesn't do any damage to you or anything like that. It's just all right to stay hydrated when you take it. Um, no other questions are there. I heard you have a new coach. How is he? Yeah, so obviously, who doesn't know? I didn't have a coach this whole time of me training. This whole two years of me training, I've never had a coach, and I recently just got one. Just before this whole quarantine thing started, I just got one, and I just got my program. And I'm literally on the second week of the program, <laughs> it literally let all the gym shut, so I had to stop. So it's a bit crazy. So yeah. But um, he's amazing. The pro literally, so when when I was doing it and he was following the program, it was going so well. I felt like I was excelling. So, yeah, that was really good. Uh, what other questions are there? Um, um, are you gonna collab with the other guys soon? I think he means by the other guys. I think he means all the people I train with, so like Nathaniel, um, Elliot, stuff like that. I missed a major one with um, everyone before and I was so mad because I've worked but the next time that the gym's open we were talking about it literally the other day so I have everyone so that um, like Nathaniel, um, Lewis and a couple of these other people I'm due to do a club with all of those guys soon so like when the gym's reopen and everyone kind of back on their, their stuff then yeah definitely gonna happen um, How did you get from being so small to so big. <laughs> I know it's sad. I feel like every time someone asks me this question, it's like so, I don't know, I feel like it's always the same answer, but it's the truth, like um, consistency, eating and hard work. Those are the only three things. Literally, I was so small. I put a picture up on the screen somewhere about how small I was when I before I started gym. Well, most people seen it because my transformation video was the last video I posted a month ago. And it's, it's been pretty well, to be honest. But I was literally so small. But literally, with just eating and hard work and just, like, consistency, I literally got so far. And it literally takes you so much. Like, people, they'll be like, oh, yeah, I go gym all the time. I don't see any progress. But they come gym and... They, they don't put in the work that you're meant to or they don't eat right. There's always something that they're missing out of those three. So like, make sure you're doing all those three things and I promise you, it will happen. Change, you will see change. Um, 
what weight class are you competing in and how tall are you? I am literally just touching six foot pretty much and I'm going to be in a 93 kg weight class. Um, I was thinking about going 105 when I first started, like before I, when I first started thinking about powerlifting, but because um, I heard a lot of people say I should go up to 105 because of my height, but um, I don't know, I feel like it's going to be too hard to maintain. 93 kg right now is actually kind of the perfect weight for me. Like all of my PRs right now, I hit at like around 91 kg. So like almost three times your body weight on most things. Other. And so like literally for me, 91, like so the 93 kg weight class right now for me is probably where it's at because I'm roughly kind of maintaining the 91 kg weight, weight and I feel it right, I feel strong, I feel good. And I don't feel too stiff either because obviously I don't know, I don't just powerlift, I'm an athlete, I play American football, stuff like that. So as you can see in the, video, in the start of the video. So yeah, I like being kind of not too heavy. I like to be able to move still and you know, be a natural athlete. Hmm. I'm gonna do like one more question because there's a few here. Some of them are pretty pointless, that's so I'm not really saying them, but yeah, I'll finish it off with let me finish off with a good one. Mm. Ooh, I don't know which one to pick. Um, would you ever consider training people? Well, I train people now, as it is, not a lot not like consistently, but like if um people ask me for like one-to-one -one sessions, I do do it in like my gym or like in a park and stuff so I do do one-to-one -one sessions every now and again it's not because I'm not fully qualified PT as such yet because obviously I work full-time I don't really have I haven't really had the time to go get the qualification I need to get you know to be able to work in the gym I need to PT people like in the gym professionally but I do train people every now and again so if you shoot me a DM we can hit one-to-one -one sessions if you're like kind of within the area or not too far out so we can meet halfway so yeah but obviously I hope you like the Q&A hope you liked you know the kind of new type of style video i did as you know i can't go to the gym so i hope you like the american football content stuff like that if you want more videos like this in the future or the foreseeable future let me know and i'll get it done love you all boy we out